when entering a citation by hand at EndNote online, click on Collect, click on New Reference, and once you're in New Reference, you can see the type, generic, you can choose different things. I'm going to choose book right now, but generally you'll have book, maybe electronic article, or possibly a journal article would be the most common types that, that I would be using. So I'm going to click book. It tells you the format for the author, so last name, comma, first name. So I'm going to put Cuban Larry, and he is the only author here, but if there are more than one, you'd enter each one on a new line. I'm going to then enter the title of the book, and it's Teachers and Machines, The Classroom, Use of Technology Since 1920. And you need to make sure you follow the APA guidelines when doing this. If this is a journal article, I wouldn't title um, capitalize every letter in the title of the journal article. The journal title itself would be capitalized, but not the, the letters in the title of the actual journal article. The next line is the year, so I'm going to select the year, and I'm going to put 1986, I believe. It is 1986. And the publisher is Teachers College Press. And the place published is New York, New York. And I think that is the basic information that I want for this one. If I wanted to add information, I could put all these things on here. I could put notes. If it was a website, I could put my URL in here, anything like that. I'm going to hit save right now. And it says reference is saved. So let's go to my references. And great. You can see that the, it came to my references. Now I have the Larry Cuban reference. So this first page on the left, you need to make sure that you notice when you click on my references, you see that I have different folders. This is all of my references, though. This folder has all of them in it. But this one is for just one part of what I'm writing or working on. So I'm going to click on that Larry Cuban book. And I'm going to say add to group. You can put it to more than one group, but for me, I just want it in my history of technology group. I'm going to click on that group. And now it's been moved, but it still stays here because this is all of my references. But if I click on history of technology, you can see that now Larry Cuban, the book is also in that source as well. So that is how you create a citation on EndNote online.